Hi, I'm Matt Naragi with FutureLogic. In this video, I'll be showing you how to install FutureLogic's Download Firmware Utility version 2.2.3 or later, or DFU 2.2.3 or later, in your Windows XP machine. Let's get started. We need to begin by making sure any old version of the DFU software has been removed from your machine. Let's use the Windows built-in search utility. Go to the Start menu, click on Search, and then click on Files and Folders, and then look for a file called dfu.sys. The results should return nothing. Let's go back and look for another file called dfuprinterfl.inf. Click on Search. There should be no results again. Let's go to the next step. Let's make sure the application has been removed from the computer. We'll need to go to the Start menu and click on the Control Panel. Then double click on Add or Remove Programs. You'll see a list of all the programs installed on your Windows XP machine. Take a quick look and make sure there are no instances of any old version of the DFU downloader on this list. If there are, simply remove it. OK. Finally, we're ready to install the application. Make sure you've got a copy of the latest application. If you don't, simply contact support at futurelogicinc.com. I suggest copying the application onto your desktop, uh, just like I've got here, and double click on it. From here, just follow the steps. Click on Next. Click on Install and let the computer go through and install the application. At some point you'll have to click on finish and you are done. You'll be prompted to restart the machine and once the computer is rebooted, let's go ahead and double check and make sure that the DFU application was installed properly. Just go through the start menu and click on the all programs, future logic, and you'll find the FL DFU application listed there. And once the application is launched, you should see a window pop up similar to what you see on the screen here. And that's it. We have installed Future Logic's Download Firmware Utility version 2.2.3 onto your Windows XP machine. Thank you for watching.